e nā koutou katoa, nā umai anō ki hunting o te aroa. Hei tēnei wiki tātou kei tūrangi mō te whakataitai Big Three. Ka kitea ko ngā mea i rere me ngā mea i mau hoki ki a ene hae ngā taumaha. A muriake, hare ngā tahi ai tātou ki te tūmau rongonui a Pete Petty ki tona wāhi pai ake ki rotu i te rohe o Tokoro. Nō reira, kia rite mai, he hōtaka whakahi hiko i te ngā kau, kei te haire. Ki te taone o tūrangi tātou e titiro atu ana ki te enanga o te whakataitai Big Three. A, ki te tūtaki ki e tahi o te tangata whenua hoki. Ko te kaupapa o te whakataitai Big Three, ki a rapu te kai whakataitai ko tahi tari ana tia, ko tahi te tari ana poaka, ko tahi te trau te hoki. E ngari kei te ahua hoha e tahi o e nei whara. A, he whiu pai hamu kei te kaupapa a ngā tamariki. He rā whakanui mō tēnei hunga e ngā kau nui ana ki te mahi aru-aru ka tahi te kaupapa rawe ko tēnei. He tewi, anei te rangatiro o tēnei krapu, the ball's nest. Rawe. I actually got a mate from Ngāpui, he's the sister club to that. The ball's nest? No, no, the sow's nest. The sow's nest. No, no, no. You've been happy with the turnout this week, mate? Hey, Howie, this is brilliant, mate. Um... I don't think we could have done any better, actually. So what's the biggest thing for you? Is it, is it the adults getting out there doing their thing or, or the tamariki or what? Definitely um, not so much the adults. It's having the tamariki here, uh, having them see what's going on. Uh, a lot of them go out with their parents, with their fathers. They go hunting and fishing. And I think just to bring everybody together and then have this sort of an occasion. So it's good. He maha ngā kai aru-aru mai te puku o te ika a Māui me te mutu whānui ka tai mai ki te whakataitai Big Three. He pai mō e nei tamariki me ngā tai tamariki e ngari ka hore e tino pai mō e nei. He maha hoki ngā whara hā te kehi ka tai mai ki e nei mō mō hui. Caught up with a little, a couple of the local hunters, well not actually local, I think this fellow's an import from Rotorua, the famous Flair family from Auau. Born to, what is it, guess? Born to provide or born to poach? How did you get on, guess? How did you get on in the competition? No, no good. Too skinny or? Yeah, my dog's too skinny, honey. Dog's too skinny. No, no. What about you, bro? Did you enter this year? Yeah, yeah. No, we got our three. Yeah, wall stag truck. Yeah, yeah. No worries. All legal. All legal, bro. Every time. So I think my cousin over here, he caught, he caught a few, but the illegal way. Oh, no. We won't go into detail, we won't go into detail. <laughs> but how long, how long have you been part of the uh, inaugural club? Myself, I've been part of it for uh, about four years now, but the Hall's Nest has been going for a long time, I think. Yes, yeah. yeah. But uh, we're a pretty staunch club. We've got over, what, 200 members uh, in the club. And we're very, very uh, passionate with our children. You know, uh, we put our children through uh, bush survival courses and... Uh, uh, firearm safety courses, and um, I, don't, I don't think if it was for our children, we wouldn't have the club that we have today. Eh? So you ever won it, bro? Sorry, what's that? Win? You ever won the comp or come close to winning? Um, yeah, won the uh, best heads. Actually, I got uh, took out first, second, and third, and the ugliest head this year. So uh, yeah. <laughs> what about any funny stories, bro? You got any funny stories? That because we've got a bit of competition going on this series, you know, the best bullshit. Oh, yeah, they follow there. True or false? Timo, Timo, Timo. They want a funny bullshit story. You got the best one, right? He's the fella for it. <laughs> Just take a look at his fucking deer. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm Timo number three, that's Timo number one. Timo number two is that tall. And, and together they make him more. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, I guess. Sorry, I guess. E hara e nei tangata i te mō mō upoko māro, he pai mō te whakatoi. 
one four five five eight. One five eight. Come here. Hey, there we are. I'm going to ah, te tahi tanga te tino ha te kehi mai konai. Kia ora, bro. Kia ora, kia ora, kia ora. Kia ora, bro. Kia ora. I heard you brought a bit of a suspect deer in there. Stay there, my cousin. Ah, that's that's the breed that they breed down here. <laughs> As you can see, my brother always always takes the pistol out of you. I told him, don't do that, don't do that. But yeah, nah, this is a bit of a laugh, eh? <laughs> Didn't get no stags, so we thought we'd get the old handler tied to the old hind leg. Yeah. So you get him last night or yesterday yeah, or this morning? Last night, last night. What about the... Uh... Porga. Yeah, the porga. Where did you get that one? Yesterday or this morning? I got that uh, Friday, Friday night. Oh, okay. Yeah, just, on, uh, just on dark. Killed my brother's dog. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, right, and I see you with the trap there too. Yeah, you got a trap. Well, I thought it was a pig, a deer, and a trap. I mean, that's the same size as our inanga we can make. Blah, blah, blah. Sorry, sorry. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to go, okay? Yeah. yeah. E pā reka reka hoki tēnei rā mō ngā tamariki, i roto i tēnei o manga i a rātou, e kawai ana i te paihamu, e whiwana rā nei i te paihamu. Engari ko te kaupapa matua o tēnei hui, ko te ine i te taumaha o ngā toko toru nunui. Ko te tikanga o te rāwhaka mutunga, kia tai mai ngā kai aruaru i mua i te paunga o te wā, kia ine ai o rātou hopunga. Ka tahi ka kitea ngā tia, ngā poaka me ngā ika e te hunga kua tai mai ki te tautoko i tēnei rā. Bullshit from the men, so I thought I'd come over here and interview these lovely ladies over here. Kia ora, Fire. Ah, uh, kia ora. Kia ora. <laughs> kia ora. Good day for the uh, Tamariki Fire. Oh, lovely Fire Day. Bayana. Ni Makri. Yes, beautiful. They were in the junior part of this year. The rabbit and the, uh, the rabbit here and the possum. Well, they didn't get any this time, did didn't they? No. I saw a couple of big ones up there on the road. You fellas should have picked them up. <laughs> What about you, Aunt? Which which one of those pork or those deer? You? Oh, I'd love the lot of them. <laughs> so you didn't go out today? Can't oh, you had to go to church this morning, eh? That's right. But hopefully you'll leave with one of them. Oh, maybe a, a hind for the race next Sunday. <laughs> what about your uh, your tani? Does he hunt? Well, well my tani is a quarter now, but he's, he used to hunt. Years ago, yeah. And how did you find that, uh, oh, being stuck well, at home by yourself on the weekend? Stuck at home, I was out on the light and I had to oh, carry yeah? the Oh, yeah? Were you out there too? <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. But My, they... Our boys used to travel on the seat and, you know, we'd go out at night. <laughs> Sometimes we'd get eight stags or plenty of deer in those days. But you're not allowed to spot the fly? Oh, of course we were. Oh, on, on your own land, that's right. <laughs> <Only on laughs> yeah, land. We were on Māori land. And you only had a candle? <laughs> yeah, bloody oath. And you jump out and whack the head off and gut him up and stick him on the yep. truck. He was bang on on the gun, straight between the eyes, the old fella. Yeah. But you'd have to be one of the fairest presidents, eh? Because you know, the president can't be going up winning all the main prizes. So you actually, that, I think that's why, why you don't want to go. Yeah. Out. That's that's what it's all about. I've done my, I've had my fair share. Man. I've won many a competition here, so uh, yeah, it's good to stand by and let let the others in for go. So. And uh, good to see new members joining the club. Very good. There's a lot of new faces here today. Um, I wouldn't say they're new to the hunting, but uh, it's good to see different people show up and, and come and enjoy themselves here. Yes. Yeah, well, unfortunately, we're supposed to be part of the top three. Our well, three, three per what is it? Three a group. We ended up with, started off with four, and we ended up with two. <laughs> and I think we're down to one because I can't find my other one. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think you, I think you might have made him shy, Howie. Uh, I think you might have made him shy, but uh, fair enough. I think you uh, gave him a hard time out there. He's probably feeling a bit tired, so yeah, we'll, we'll let him off there. Oh, well, Dave, thank you for having us hey, here, mate. Howie, thank you very much. It's good to have you here. And next time you get one, just tie it up and we'll come down. Next time we'll have it all ready for you, mate. You won't even have to go out and look for them. Okay. <laughs> hey, muri nga fagatai ranga ka hoki mai ano tātou me ngā tohu tohu o te wiki. 
A, ka haere ngā tahi maua, ko te tahi tūmau rongonui ki te aruaru. Kai time on the road! Oh, hey, my oh. road! E te iwi kua tau mai te wā, ko ruru awhina. Adam, hea atu kaupapa mo tarā. Ok, uh, today we're going to talk about uh, navigational tools. Ok, a few little tips here. Ok, back in, a, you know, back in our forefathers' days, they used the starlight to navigate the stars. Um, we've progressed on to the old compass. Ok, compass and the topographical map. And from there, we've progressed on to the GPS system. Which stands for what? Global Positioning System. This one is by uh, Magellan, it's Explorers 500. Now what this particular unit has, has the compass and has the topographical maps all on this one unit. So we've got the whole of New Zealand on here. Um, it will show us the roads, contours, rivers, streams, etc. Now they're an amazing unit. Once you turn them on and they pick up the satellites, they will show us exactly where we are on the map. Um, great thing about these units is that we can actually mark if we shot an animal or mark from a position that we need to know how to get back to, we can do that, we can wander off, this will track us with, by, via satellites, and when we need to go back, we push another button, go to, and then it will take us straight back home. Now what we need to remember though, is that these units will show us the shortest way home, okay, which generally from the shortest way between one point and another, it won't show you the quickest way home. But with the map, uh, we know exactly what kind of terrain we're actually walking over. Okay, well this with a computer, to make things simple and enable us to uh, uh, plan our trips or plan our hunt trips, we can do it at home, in the comfort of our home, we can have a look at the terrain, and these computers are, uh, can interface with the PC unit, and they will talk to each other, and you can transfer data that you've uh, plotted down from this to your PC, and vice versa. Good thing too is that uh, if we go away and we happen to be late home, family members can turn on that PC, have a look at the area that we've marked out, and as long as we haven't deviated, they can give the search and rescue um, people the coordinates of that area, help confine that uh, search search rescue time down. Not that you get lost, mate? Not, not with one of these, bud. I reckon, Not one of these. They're just fantastic. Um, there's no way you should get lost with one of these, as long as you know how to use them. Awesome. You're welcome. E hari atu ana o ki te aruaru tahi me taku tūmau a Pete Petty. Kai time on the road. Oh, who? Hey, my hey, bro. Hey, bro. Good, good, good. good. Shit, good. It looks like a bloody hell's kitchen here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, still got kai on the table. Still got bloody kai on the table, eh, mate? But hey, you're a bit of a hunter these days. Yeah, I'm trying to, mate. I'm trying to. <laughs> but what a lot of people don't realise is that you're not only a great chef. You're a great hunter too, bro. Oh, Fanatic. Just love it, eh? I love it. I just got this the other day. Up uh, One month I went up there with a few of the cuzzy bros, you know, they took me up. Saw heaps of deer. Just took out one, you know, that's all we needed for a kai. Brought it back. There it is. And all this, mate, I'm giving that out to all the different people. I'll there. happily take some off your hands, my brother. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> can't buy, bro. Can't buy. How you been? Good, mate. Choice. And you got a few trophies hanging up in the old shed there, bro? Yeah, I got a few antlers there with uh, some of the places that I've been to. The dates even, you know, bring back a lot of memories. I call that my uh, horny shit. Horny shit? <laughs> <laughs> few, uh, few, uh, tusks as well, you know, good sized pigs. And that, that's all I do is I go in there and I have a look and it brings back all those memories of that good hunt, you know. Going out with so and so, blah, 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 and you can sit in there and when you're having a bit of a party and you talk about it and they get bigger and bigger and bigger, you know, Otis. Did I uh, miss out on the hunt or are we going to go for a hunt or? No, no, actually you were a little bit late, but we can still head out there to the forest area over in Tokoro. Hi. Got your permit? I've got my permit. Yeah, I've got mine. See, because you don't poach, eh? Got to have, no, 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 got to have your high-vis too. High-vis, i got my high-vis. Kawai. And you don't poach because the only thing you poach is eggs. That's right. All right. Kawai, wait, wait. Wait, wait. Okay, into mate. it, into it. Where are you? You keep poached eggs. <laughs> <laughs> Poto noi ho te taraiwa mai i roto rua ki ngā ngā heri o Tokoroa. Engari, ki hayau i mōhio, he mahi whakatoke tō pit. First one's here, bro. Yeah, mate. It's unusual because this is quite a popular road too. Oh, yeah? Many pigs down here. Well, uh, first time for everything, mate. I can't say I've ever gone hunting on a pushbike before. 
Well, see, see your walker, hey? Do you like this one? Hey, what's this one about? Last time I seen something like that was on mesh. <laughs> <laughs> That's right for you, dead <laughs> army. Yeah. Tracks through there, bro. No, it's, it's all, uh, not out any motor power vehicles in the forestry here. It's all manpower. You can either uh, ride a horse in, or you can take the bikes, or you can beat the feet. That's your bike, V. This is you sure you can handle it? Hey. Oh, horse. Oh, horse. Oh, the hell, mate. <laughs> I think bloody Tukorti was the last one to ride that around the bloody hills, wasn't he? Come on. Come on. Come on. The breeze coming right down towards the seal. Now, the other thing is, we've got to tie these dogs up because you can't hunt them on the seal. Okay. So we'll have to um, hook up these mutts and guide them through actually until we get off the seal and then we can start hunting them. You ready bro? Alright. Are we walking or riding? Where you go? Are you riding too or what? I want to know what you ride. <laughs> <laughs> Come here. There's a lot of prickles around. How are we? Little blackberries. Yeah. A lot that's of where blackberries. I got the old chaps here. No, but the pigs love it eh? and that's why there's quite a few over this side. Yeah. Full on blackberries mate. So how do your dogs work, Pete? Well, they actually work off the wind. They've got a couple that work off the wind and one will work off the scent of the pig. But uh, you always got to have that breeze in your face, otherwise, you know, if, you, if you've got the breeze coming, following you up the gully or wherever you go, the, the pigs are going to smell you first and poof, and they get that head start, eh? But if you, if you use your hunting tactics wisely, mm. keep that breeze in your face, go around the blocks, and they should be able to pick it up. Oh, they'll pick it up. They can smell the pigs, eh? I can if sense something else happening. I can sense something else coming up. <laughs> well, actually, if you know, sometimes you have to actually go through the block as well, Lee, eh? because you can see the sign on the outside. Some of it may be a couple of days old, but guarantee if you take a couple of steps into the block, I mean, get away from the prickles, there'll be fresher stuff in there. You have to get into the middle because sometimes there's little guts and ruts and swamps inside, and they can't pick up the scent. Eh? So you got to take it into it. Kia hoki mai anō a muri i ngā whakatairanga, kei konei anō a Pete Miti. Ai, he Miti hoki tō mātou, tau kuri e. Ka haere tonu te whakatoi, tai noa ki te wai ki te ngā kuri e ngauana i te tahi uha. Do you have any pig dogs of your own, the uh, hiwaroa? Two legged ones. Two legged ones. <laughs> 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 they must be good dogs, eh? Sprint. Where the old bloody pigs usually hang out there, bro? Well, when you sort of start looking towards the middle of the day there, they camp out in little cold gullies, eh? Or swamps, or up high on knobs where it's a bit cooler in the breeze. Your shoulders are looking good there, Gus. <laughs> <laughs> Yours are looking better. <laughs> Ka haere tonu te whakatoi, tai noa ki te wai ki te anga kuri e ngauana i te tahi uha. Ka araue, i kore e i pau raua te wera wera i tērā. Tia le, tia le. Ka pai pata. Ai bloody sao i. Oh boy. Two miles are right there, hell. <laughs> Two miles are right there, brother. <laughs> hey, reckon. We're good? The dogs, good girl. Good dogs. Awesome. That's what we're after, eh? Not only a bloody chef there, mate. Not only a chef, my bro. Dedicated hunter. Dedicated yeah. legal oh. hunter. Got to get out. <laughs> <laughs> you and me, bro. Ko tau atu a ki toru he kona noi hoa no. Ah, kua watea mātou ki ta pahu pahu. Me te whakata a hoki. With the bike ride, ever? With the bike ride. Now we can put it on your flash waka. That was the first time we've been hunting on the old push bike there, bro. <laughs> True, bro. You haven't done it on the push bike yet? 
So they laughed at myself when I saw those bush boys. I was wondering what they were for. It's I quite amazing, you... quite amazing the way you see all these uh, well-built hunters with big pukui and they come out on these uh, flash bikes for the thing, for the forestry, but that's part of the um, club rules, eh? I thought you were going to do your paper run on the way out. <laughs> <laughs> we'll join up with the mountain tracking club. Cruise around on the bikes. No, it's neat fun though, eh? it makes it so much easier too. You don't have to carry it all the way back to your wakai. Eh? Mm -hmm. It's good. Back to the old bikes here, mate. <laughs> Wouldn't want to carry that all the way back to the truck. Nah, nah, well, that's why we bought those things. I'll show you, I'll show you how we normally fit this onto the, uh, onto the old bike here. With that middle piece there, with that middle plywood. Normally you can sit them up there like that if you want to, or, you know, tie them all on, or you can stick the old uh, legs like that and tie the pig on and then you can still ride, eh? You can jump on there and hey. ride with your pig. It looks, looks quite hard case though, eh? Well, the VT can do it, the pig can do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> what about this one here? Eh? Well, that one there, that's easy, eh? That's why I thought, uh, instead of tying this whole pig up, all yours. That Don't is... have to tie it up and you can still ride us out. And that's why I bought that bike for you. On the old stretcher. It's on the stretcher, man. Ready to go. You can stick another couple of pigs on there before one comes on mine. Bit of CPR on the while before we leave. <laughs> How you well, going, eh? That's us. Don't even have to, to tie the, it up. Let's get back to this truck, mate. It's getting bloody wetter. <laughs> hey? Time for a drink. I reckon. Come on, then. Let's go. You know, my catch one on the way here. Now you try. All good? Uh, I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> not after that last pump. <laughs> Come on, bro. Ko tai atu mātou ki ngā ngahere pai nō tokoro, me whai raihana ki a uru koe ki runga ki i nei whenua ka tika. Ko te tika ngā ki a mau ki tau a raihana, me ta raihana pū hoki, nā te mea, ki i katoa te ngahere i ngā apiha nei. Ko bai, bro? I think so, bro. I think so. Kia ora. Kia ora. How's it German? How's it going? Oh. That was him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he looks like suspicious. <laughs> How's things? Good. Mm -hmm. Pete, 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 Pete's a neck. Pete. 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 Uh, just uh, for security, we come to check up on your permits and things. What's that? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> well, you better have well, one, guys. He's got the marry there, bro. He's got the marry there. Well, that's that ugly fella there. Is that passable? Yeah. And your um, gun license, please? Yep, let you turn around. Oh, we're going to do our rounds first, and if we see you on the road, we'll pick you up. Okay, okay mate. Choice, okay. choice. See you on this road? Yep. Down the boy. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Well. Mate, don't move. Just stay here. <laughs> Down the road. Yep. <laughs> You reckon about 80 pounder? On the scales? Oh. Eh? 80 on the scales, 120 after a few beers. <laughs> Everyone knows you're a good chef, and now they know you're a fanatic hunter. Which one's your passion? Well, actually, uh, hunting has always been my passion. Eh? Um, I've got to get out there once a week at least. So straight from the bush, right to the table. Straight from the bush to the table, but no hairs on it, you know, like maybe some of your dishes. <laughs> no no um, dirt or anything, keeping it nice and clean because you, as you're a chef, you, you become uh, quite um, critical with the hygiene. Eh? Even though, oh, you know, we can go out there and get blood all over us and that, but once it comes back into my domain here for preparation, I take over. I'm the one who pretty much wants to clean the animals up, eh? It's all those skills that you pick up when you become a chef. You're the man, mum. <laughs> you are the man from the bush to the table. You're the man, mate. Because awesome. you're the man, I'll let you have the last say. Oh, buy your hat then. You want to buy my hat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to look the part. And that's our show for this week, hunting Aotearoa. How's it? How's it? How's it?
Pretty cake, man. I can do better than that. How's this one? Bon appetito! <laughs> Modi ora! <laughs> yeah, yeah, stick yeah, give my bloody head roll. back again. Yeah, carry on with this bloody pig. <laughs> hey, te ra wiki tātou ke ta whare aru aru o rangi nui ki āria. He wāhi noho tatana ki te kuiti. Ko din bō te tahi e whai ora ngā ana i rotu e ngā mahi arahi kai aru aru. A, ka kite a tātou i te turuhi e mahi aru aru ana. get lost, eh, mate? Not with one of them. <laughs> okay. Adam, how are the Cobra Mokta that? <laughs> oh, sorry, there's a girl present. Adam, how are the Cobra Mokta that? Yeah, how are the Cobra Mokta that? Hey, Paul.